This tutorial is designed to help explain what ASCII characters are and how you use them, in particular the character term with UART. Basically every single character on the screen is an ASCII character, whether it's this capital D, the little e, the equal sign, the bracket, even the character term. You can't see it, it just, in, it just inserts a new line. If you want to know what any particular ASCII code is, click on plugin, go down to ASCII table, and here you'll have a list uh, starting at decimal 000, going all the way through to 127 for most of the ASCII characters you would ever need to use. Uh, if just say for example I wanted to send hi with the letter H followed by the letter I, I could uh, send 104 which is a little h and 105 which is a little i and it display that on the uh, UART output. I made a little program to explain how that works using the USART library and sending the ASCII character 104 you just need to write the decimal value and then delaying for two seconds then writing 105 so I go to my simulation software and start the simulation and you see there's a H followed by I from here uh, a handy tool to use is the carriage return basically the carriage return uh, allows you to insert a new line so for this first example I've got hello world followed by how are you when you put something in uh, quotation swordfish will turn it into ASCII characters and uh, turn the string into ASCII characters so that it can be displayed the way you've, uh, you've written it in this format so if I go to my simulation software and load that program you can see there's hello world followed by how are you notice there's no new line though. I, what I'd like to do is uh, put a carriage return after this first string so that how are you comes up on the next line. So I go back to my program and I'm just gonna, I'm gonna put a comma 13. 13 in my ASCII table is a carriage return and so this is uh, the equivalent of pressing enter in between these two strings. I'll recompile that and go back to my software and run the simulation again. Hello world, how are you? Okay well I hope that's helped somebody out. Uh, how you use ASCII characters from here is up to you and just keep in mind that they are there and they're handy to use.